Military Tribunal 1. Nuremberg, November 21st, 1946. Military Tribunal Number 1. United States of America versus Carl Brandt and others. Better known as the medical case. Answer the questions which I shall propound to him. Is your name Werther Oberhauser? Yes, sir. Have you received and have you had an opportunity to read the indictment filed against you? Yes, sir. Have you entered your plea of not guilty to this indictment and do you now plead not guilty to this indictment? This Charlie. You may be seated. Dr. Hertha Oberhäuser was a young and attractive woman in 1946. She was accused of having tortured dozens of concentration camp inmates, of having artificially infected wounds, of having administered lethal injection. And in your affidavit, you admit that you gave five or six lethal injections, is that correct? Nein. Well, you gave injections, and after such injections, the persons died, did they not? Ich habe, ich habe vorhin schon gesagt und habe bei meiner direkten Vernehmung gesagt, dass es sich um eine ärztliche Hilfe für leidende Patienten in der Agonie handelte. And this medical aid resulted in death, did it not? No. I said, and this medical aid resulted in death, did it not? Wie ich sagte, es sind Patienten gewesen, die sich in der Agonie befanden. Miss Oberhauser, were you ever given any awards or medals? Wenn ich mich recht entsinne, war es, glaube ich, die Kriegsverdienstmedaille. And for what reason did you receive that medal? Das weiß ich nicht. Was it for your participation in the sulfonilamide experiments? Das, das gewiss nicht. I have no further questions, Your Honor. This morning, Tribunal Number One has convened in order to hear statements by the defendants in person. Es gibt ein Wort, das scheint sehr einfach und befehlen. Maßlos sind die Konflikte, die hinter dem Gehorchen sich verstecken. Nüchtern stellt die Anklage die Behauptung von Verbrechen und Mord dagegen und erhebt die Frage meiner Schuld. Es wäre ohne Bedeutung, wenn Freunde und Patienten sich vor mich stellten, um Gutes von mir zu sagen. Das alles ist jetzt belanglos. Ich werde einer solchen Anklage um meinetwillen nicht ausweichen. Ich bekannt wurde Mensch und als Arzt. These statements are now concluded. After over seven months of trial, assuming I think 139 trial days, a hearing of over 80, 85 witnesses, reception and evidence of many hundreds of documents and affidavits, the trial insofar as the reception of evidence, the arguments of counsel, the personal statements of the defendants is now concluded. The tribu tribunal will now recess and enter upon the preparation of the judgment to be rendered in this cause.
The evidence in the case of the United States of America versus Carl Brandt and others defendants having been closed and counsel for the prosecution and the defendants having filed their briefs and submitted them to the tribunal. The tribunal, after consideration of the evidence and the briefs filed, is now ready to pronounce its judgment. The jurisdiction and powers of this tribunal are fixed and determined by law number 10 of the Control Council for Germany. The pertinent portions of the law with which we are concerned provide as follows. Article 2, 1. Each of the following acts is recognized as a crime. B, war crimes. Atrocities or offenses against person or property constituting violations of the laws or customs of war, including but not limited to murder, ill treatment, or deportation to slave labor or for any other purpose of civilian population from occupied territory. Murder or ill treatment of prisoners of war or persons on the seas, killing of hostages, plunder of public or private property, wanton destruction of cities, towns, or villages, or devastation not justified by military necessity. Wilhelm Bagelbach, Military Tribunal 1, has found and adjudged you guilty of war crimes and crimes against humanity, as charged under the indictment heretofore filed against you. For your said crimes, on which you have been and now stand convicted, Military Tribunal 1 sentences you, Wilhelm Bagelbach, to imprisonment for a term of 15 years. Fritz Fischer, Military Tribunal 1 has found and adjudged you guilty of war crimes, crimes against humanity, and membership in an organization declared criminal by the judgment of the International Military Tribunal as charged under the indictment heretofore filed against you. For your said crimes, on which you have been and now stand convicted, Military Tribunal 1 sentences you, Fritz Fischer, to imprisonment for the full term and period of your, natu of your natural life, Becker Freising, to imprisonment for a term of 20 years, to be served at such prison or prisons or other appropriate place of confinement as shall be determined by competent authority. Tolbohoiser, Military Tribunal 1 has found and adjudged you guilty of war crimes and crimes against humanity. For your said crimes, Military Tribunal 1 sentences you, Werther Oberhäuser, to imprisonment for a term of 20 years. The officer of the guard will remove the defendant, Werther Oberhäuser. Frau Oberhäuser, entschuldigen Sie die Störung von Namen. Mein Name ist Offels. Ich hätte gern gewusst, ob Sie bereit wären, uns... Rostock ist tot. Carl Brandt, Military Tribunal 1 has found and adjudged you guilty of war crimes, crimes against humanity, as charged under the indictment heretofore filed against you. Military Tribunal 1 sentences you, Carl Brandt, to death by hanging, and may God have mercy upon your soul. The officer of the guard will remove the defendant, Brandt. How do you feel about capital punishment? If you are asking about capital punishment in the United States, I'm among its opponents because it has come to be applied in a... In a...